I really feel respected. I feel that there's there's a room for each individual MP's voice to be heard to represent their community and their constituents. Mm. Um, and then there's the process of, of various caucuses. So that's how it kind of works through the, the, the channel. So we've got the New Brunswick caucus, which I am so fortunate to be the chair of. Mm. Um, I've got access to, of course, Jeanette and Dominic for their, their cabinet perspective. Um, my amazing colleagues from the north as well. So we're gelling as our New Brunswick crew and we talk about the issues that are important for us here in the province. We bring that then to our Atlantic caucus, which is with our, our other colleagues, of course, from the Atlantic region, which is interesting to see the comparisons, say, in Nova Scotia or the differences in Newfoundland Labrador. Mm. A really amazing synergy kind of happens in the Atlantic caucus room. Then we bring that to National Caucus, where we have first an opportunity to just share what were our kind of key points for that week, what mm. are the key issues we want to highlight to the Prime Minister and to the Cabinet. And then you have the general list, where people are able to just get up and talk about these important issues that are for them maybe on a more individual or constituency basis. Mm. Um, and it's, it feels like you know, the wheels start to move. So it's, it's been, you know, for me on some of these issues that I didn't think anyone else was bringing up. First of all, I've found other allies that are absolutely raising these concerns, but also that they're willing to listen, even if it's something like banning glyphosate, which not a lot of my colleagues understand or why it's so important to me, but they're very supportive and which I didn't expect. So it's mm. the process has been encouraging. Um, and so it's, it's a little less of the, of the top down that I really was expecting and more of this environment where you can talk through things and you have a chance to really fight for things that matter to you.